The district commissioner of Karan district, Abshir Muhammad, has confirmed that he has held face-to-face -face talks with some of the members of the notorious Iyal Wero gang amid raising concern about increased crimes committed by the youth gangs. In an exclusive interview with Dalsan TV on Sunday evening, the district commissioner said the meeting took place in Kopdoro Stadium and none of the members of the gang often involved in violent crimes, including robbery, extortion and murder were arrested. He advised the members of the group to look for a job and those in possession of weapons to return to the government. In early 2021, an upsurge in cases brazen robberies and muggings in the capital city of Mogadishu was witnessed. Residents of Mogadishu have been raising concerns about increased crimes committed by the youth gangs. Karan district and Madina, which consist of Darkenle and Wadajir districts, are one of the most affected areas with Real Wero gang terrorizing the residents. The move by the district commissioner comes just days after the head of the state, Hassan Sheikh Mohamud, unveiled a new paramilitary unit tasked with maintaining security in the capital Mogadishu. The president inspected the new unit in Hilwene camp located between Mogadishu and the middle Shabele town of Balad. According to a statement from Villa Somalia, the new military police unit will ensure the safety of Mogadishu and fight against incursions by the militant group Al-Shabaab. The president called on the new forces to conduct themselves professionally and ethnically and are there to human rights principles. Mogadishu and the larger Benadir have been under the security of various Mogadishu and the larger Benadir have been under security of various military and police units including the National Intelligence and Security Agency, NISA.